big do you want these? I don't know. How big do you want them? Just okay. understand, make them all the same size because we're cooking them. So the thing is, is these are two very different sized carrots. See, like, this so is you, you, this is Alex Jones. <laughs> Could you just give me, like, a little bit more? Jeez, like, there? <laughs> Fucking hell. What's up? This is Cooking with Nathan, and this is... I'm Jay Taylor. Hi. And today we are going to be making a roasted chicken with uh, garlic roasted potatoes and a honey... Uh, honey, what are they? Uh, you said they pepper. Called? Honey pepper carrots, yeah. Better pepper carrots. Sound good? Yes. Fuck yeah. Mm. <laughs> so you've been doing this for a smidgen of time, right? I've been living by myself and cooking for... I was talking about porn. Oh. Yeah. Okay, cool. Because you do one. that, right? Porn I do, yeah. Allegedly, but I do porn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I do. How long? 10 years. 10 years? I, technically 12 if we're counting camming. Oh shit, so you only got in like three years before I did. Yeah. You know we're old people in this job now? Yes, I do. I do shoot as much mainstream or more. It's mostly your own stuff. <laughs> what? I okay. So my last mainstream gig, I guess we could count Ultimate Evolved Les with Ariel as mainstream. Wait, but did you fucker? I did, How but was that was it? for a custom. I've been I've been watching Ariel for like the whole time, like ten years, and so she needed a custom. She's like, I just need a girl who will come out and go down on me like really aggressively. I'm like, I will. Do that. I would tuck it back to do it. I would do that, and um, it was it, to be able to like look down or look up at her face. I was like, oh my god. Oh. Oh. So your stuff is mostly like, where do you put your all your uh, efforts? I do content trade. Though I mean, you know, I mean, COVID s slowed things down and changed a lot of things. Like if you remember, like I used to do tons of shoots all the time. Mm -hmm. Um. So now I do a lot of solo, but I do do some content trades still, and I do um, I do a lot of audio porn. I've gotten really into audio in the last year. Uh, you're gonna have to explain a little more. You don't know about audio well, uh, porn. So audio porn, um, there's there's a couple things to do. It. It's um, you can do a, a ramble fap, which is like a solo, <laughs> which is like a solo scene, just audio based, or you can do a role play, which is like me directly to you. So the last one I did, um, how much can I talk about on here? I need to just like Anything. PG-13 it up a bit. Okay, so in the last I one- don't I don't make any money off it, doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> oh, okay, so in the last one I did, I, um, I'm your wife. Cool, cool. And um, so you're my husband, you're listening as my husband. I love you, baby. I love you too. And we are headed toward the park okay. to um, play with some strangers, do some dogging. Like play like swing with them? Hot. hot it was okay. super hot. And so like we get to the park and um, I actually got my favorite audio creator to collaborate with me. He's actually on YouTube. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, so he, uh, we do some stuff. We do some, some, some moaning and some dirty talk. So, so in this, it's like you didn't actually go to the park. You are just no. in the room just talking. I'm in my closet talking to a microphone and he's okay, so in like the a... UK talking to a microphone and we edit them together. Nice. Oh, that's cool. It's like, super those cool. do okay? They are, monetarily speaking, it's really kind of a tiny, tiny little niche market. Mm -hmm. So not many people knows it, know about it. Okay. But creatively, I've never been able to. Oh, Sorry. Ignore that. Ignore that. I've never been able to pour myself into my work as much as I can with audios because it can. I can do whatever I want. Like I did one where I cloned myself and there were two of me and I was in a science lab. You move a rough chop on that. <laughs> Maybe I want it chunky, Nathan. That's cool. That's not how this works, SpongeBob. Yes, Mr. Krabs. Yeah. yeah. So guys, and nowadays we have to How big do you want these? I don't know, how big do you want them? Just understand, make them all the same size because we're cooking them. So the thing is, is these are two very different sized carrots. See, like this so, is you, would you, this is Alex Jones. <laughs> Could you just give me like a little bit more? Jeez, like there? <laughs> Fucking hell. Um, <laughs> hi, Alex. Um, oh, did you just pick up the darker one? <laughs> yeah, that was mistake. That was on the floor. No. So you started pouring, and like one of the things you started yeah. finding a niche in was actually your whole uh, mini vids, cliff sale, yeah. OnlyFans. Yeah. Uh, like, which one does the best for you? Actually, let me put that. Let's go yeah, back. Yeah, Could you explain that. those sites? 
Okay. For everyone who just finds <laughs> porn on like Pornhub and uh, X Video and what are the fucking other ones? Tube sites. Tube sites. Just find some porn. Tube sites. Free Would you explain where you can actually uh, what the support the people? Other sites are. The OnlyFans is the big one in the household name um, that kind of exploded, particularly during COVID. Excuse you. It's so lemony. Um, yeah. And so that one is um, subscription based for the most part. And I think a lot of the draw with that site is having interaction with the creator themselves. So you subscribe to be able to communicate, chat, send messages. But the problem with it being a household name and having so many billions of dollars coming through OnlyFans, like it's a, like, like stupid, stupid money through OnlyFans, is um, it's been kind of taken over by companies and bots. And there are still people who run their own accounts or run their accounts with help. Um, but there are also bots, and so there's like, I'm rambling. No, but that's fine. Yeah, cool. But you're explaining what this is, because yeah. we're about to go into the whole process of what you do with yeah, yeah, all that. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so basically the model for most OnlyFans is a low subscription fee, and then you can buy full scenes for a higher price once you're in the, on the platform, in the site, subscribed. Mm. Okay. And so you work on OnlyFans and maybe it's a close show, right? Yes. Like these are like those your big are ones? my big three. Okay. Um, and those are all, it's not subscription as much as you're buying videos. Yes. So Clips for Sale and Mini Vids um, are kind of similar. Mini Vids is trying to do like everything at once. So there's a lot more things you can do on Mini Vids. I use Mini Vids like a clip store, which a clip, and Clips for Sale is a dedicated clip store, which is no contact, no interaction that you can't message on many of it, and it's just a place to kind of park your content. Mm, okay. Set it and forget it. Okay. Diversifying your income streams. Yeah, because uh, <laughs> would you tell people why that's a good idea oh in my this God. job? Okay, so like remember like a year or two ago when OnlyFans said they were going to not do porn anymore and everyone freaked out? Yeah. That's why you diversify your income streams, because that shit can happen. Yes, true. And for like any reason at any time, any of your sites. In the last 10 years, you've seen yeah. a lot of things come and go in this industry. What has been some of the bigger changes that you've come across? Oh, um, talent managing their own freaking shit and um, saying, yeah, I don't need to do that anymore to scenes. Mm -hmm. And I like that shift. It's a good shift. It's an interesting shift. I like us taking back the power. Yeah. For sure. Um, I know it made producers nervous, which I always like. Mm. Do you actually come in scenes? So many times. <laughs> what would you say to the girls who can't? Stop thinking about it. Um, Just because stop, think about there's different kinds of orgasms. So like the kind of orgasm I have by myself. Potatoes, potatoes. Potatoes? All of them? Yeah. The kind of orgasms I have by myself when I'm masturbating um, is not the kind of orgasm I have with a partner. I but know. I do have- Get the butter all over them. <laughs> get the butter everywhere but I you know I it's, it's still a release it's mm -hmm. still a good freaking time yeah so I had to teach myself to recognize different things as an orgasm mm. but also there's like a lot of pressure yeah oh I know and also like maybe stop fucking people if you don't like it like that's the, the fucking hard that truth sounds like crazy talk. that's the fucking hard truth there because it's so like okay like the, it's definitely different for men and women because yeah. you you have to come. Oh, yeah, I know. You ha that's oh, like I'm your number there, one bitch. job. I fucking know. That's your number one job. Like no, you have no, to be hard. No, number one job is getting your dick hard. You have Second to be hard is to come. And then to come. Like and there, you you have to. Yeah. And I don't even have to think about. I can think. I think about burgers. Like if I don't like you, I am definitely thinking about what I'm going to eat afterward. Yeah. So do I. Yeah, I bet you do. That's how you come, huh? Yeah. So it's an orgy and it's like a sex toy orgy. So there's like big giant vibrators and like pocket pussies and dolls. It's because it was a storage horse. Mm. You're a storage horse? Storage horse. Horse. Oh, I think it's a storage horse. Storage yeah, horse. Yeah, yeah. It's the parody. It was a blast. I got lit on fire on the show. Uh, did you? That was you? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's sweet. Yeah, it's nice. I love that for you. Um, so I'm getting railed and this chick is next to me using this big giant wand vibrator. Mm -hmm. And she starts squirting. Yeah. And it is the color of dandelions, as it is sometimes. <laughs> and the guy who was fucking me, like, 
leapt out of my pussy and dove face first into this chick. And I was just like, oh, okay. And then so I kind of scooted over away from her on the couch. And like we finished the scene and the scene finishes with this giant bukkake. And then like Evan Stone puts on like this beer cock. So he fills like this plastic cock with beer and like shoots it all over us. And then like, I remember like we got up and we're like covered in alcohol and like cum and sweat. And I look over and there's this woman and she's like, was pissed. And I'm like, oh shit, that must be a producer. It was not. So I went over and I'm like, oh, hey, thanks for watching. It was such a fun scene. Are you like a part of the company? And she's like, I'm the homeowner. Oh. I'm like, I'm very sorry. And then I went to the shower. So how many couches? Did you fuck up one couch or did that fuck it up? It was the, there was a couch. There was a sex swing. We pee, she peed and fucking spilled beer all over the floor. So it was all over their rugs. And I just went, okay, sorry. So um, I need to do my check. <laughs> it's carrots. It's not going to soak up as much butter. How much butter does your carrot soak up? We're going to find out. Aren't we? So much butter on your carrot. Oh, so much butter. I'm like, ah, fuck. And remember, the so whole time, buttery. I, need you to, I need you to keep tossing. Keep tossing the salad and the potatoes? Yeah, just keep tossing that. I'm going to use the fucking thing. I don't want to hurt my wrist. Really? Well, see, I get carpal tunnel because I masturbate too much. Because mm. I have to hold the vibrator like all kind of crazy. Do you masturbate more now than before you were in porn? I masturbate so much. <laughs> I masturbate a lot. I like, it's like a stim for me. So I feel like, ow, motherfucker. I feel like I have to, I, I, I got to do it. I like doing it. What are some of the stuff that you like? Like was like wits end. I'm like I'm not doing that. Oh. Because it's like I think we all hit a point where it's like I got asked to do something. I'm not doing. I um. I don't. I'm not mean. So I get a lot of requests for femdom. I get a lot of requests for humiliation. Not so much anymore because I'm just like guys. I don't. I don't do that. I'm fucking nice. Like yeah. I don't. I'm not mean to you. And I'm kind of getting a lot of armpit fetishists. You don't like that? <sighs> they want me to lick my own armpits. I just don't love it. Yeah. I don't love it. Okay. Uh, shall we partake? Yeah. All right. Um, let's dig in. We'll see uh, how it goes, huh? I'll shoot you. I feel like I need a knife. Why? So, mm. cut into my chicken. Oh. oh my God. Dude. Okay. Potatoes are really good. Mm -hmm. The extra salt was needed. Yeah. I mean, it usually is the potatoes. The carrots are... Carrots. Right? What are you Good? I am impressed. But you were always impressive. Should what are you talking about? You did. You led me, you held my hand. No, 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 no. You smashed the garlic. Mm. But anyway, while we're, while we're eating this and um, while we have a little bit more time on this. Okay. Okay. Making money in porn. <laughs> in general. Mm -hmm. Someone coming in, mm -hmm. they're, they're, they're like, I'm gonna start doing porn. I'm gonna start fucking for a living. Give them your inspiration on what they should do. As I think someone who's been very successful oh, yeah. on the other side of just not mainstream, but on clips. Mm -hmm. Shoot your own content, diversify your income streams, build consistency, follow people who are doing it themselves and not just like famous celebrities. Like if you wanna do porn and your inspiration is Karen Lee, it's a little different. It might not go for you exactly like it went for Karen. If, you're, if your inspiration is a valid danger, it's a little different. Sometimes it's amazing. Like we've had, a, we both had like incredible days on set where like, holy shit, I'm getting paid for this. Oh yeah. But it's not always like that. Yeah. So doing it yourself, something you like and can be consistent at mm -hmm. is good. Um, also, don't do anything for money. You wouldn't probably under the right circumstances do for free. Yep and assume everyone's gonna find out. Good talk. Hey guys, thank you for coming in for another episode of Cooking with Nathan. Um, if you like the show, please like, subscribe, follow, because guess what? We need followers so we can get people to sponsor the show, so we can pay for the show, because you guys ain't doing it, because it is free. Also check out the merch store. New things coming out every week. We just got a new so Toy Store fun. logo, and my favorite, the Bass Pro Shop logo as Cooking with Nathan. Check it out. 
Also, get my sandals. I want the sandals. My face is on my sandals. Not you have these sandals ones. with your face on yeah, them? Yeah, it's fucking so dope. Cool. Um, go check that out, guys. Uh, new episodes coming out every week. Come on, check them out. And uh, go cook some food. Also, diversify the income, guys. Diversify your income streams. Diversify your income. Talk to y'all later. Bye. Yay.